All right, so this video is going to kick off in my dad's basement, uh, followed by going to a thrift shop up by my dad. So you'll see me going through all that stuff, and then afterwards I'll show you the hauls that I got from each. Cases and cases so. of these. They go on like light, what are they called, gels. This stained glass lenses for uh, cases of these. I gotta see if I can find them online. Cases. Look them up online. Cases. Cases. Look, Justin. Ooh, lighting. These were in dis on display cases. I can always use some lighting. Ain't they cool? They're really cool. Nobody ever had those a, things had a death pile like this before. This is the ultimate death pile. Look, all I, of this came from Pier One. I want to check out that Grindomatic. Yeah, I got some nice some old crap. Yeah. That wall there's got real old shit on it. Dad said I'd sell everything on eBay. So That's if you see something you like, right there too, brand new. See something you wrote it once. See something you like, let me know. <laughs> Chandeliers. Oh, I'm farting. Look, okay. Justin. Glass chandelier. Came out of a hotel in Manhattan. Oh my god, Dad. You don't really like a hoarder house. <laughs> yeah, this was supposed to be our yard sale that she never took. <laughs> Do you have a mannequin? I need a mannequin. Oh, I got rid of all the mannequins. I think I found two of those beanie babies I was talking about today. Sorry, it's been a couple days. Uh, I went up to New York and my laptop screen is broke so I couldn't bring my editing laptop. I'm back and plus I got this new job. Had a big first project I was working on. Uh, so I'll upload as often as I can. I'll try to do every day but I'll, I'll at least do four times a week for sure. All right, so I'm gonna show you the haul. I got a couple hauls. I went to a thrift store up near my dad um, in Bear Mountain, New York. I picked up a bunch of stuff at this uh, thrift store and then I raided my dad's basement as you saw with the, the videos earlier. I raided my dad's house and grabbed a bunch of stuff he had laying around. Uh, <laughs> Alright, so I'll get to it. 
All right, first up is a ton of Beanie Babies. These were a buck a piece. I got all of these, they're kind of common. I'm gonna just lot them up and sell this lot for like 50 to 75 bucks. But the interesting ones are here. All right, now look this one up, Valentino. And he's, he doesn't have all seven errors, but he does have two of the seven errors. The seven error ones are like five to seven thousand dollars. But this guy's worth a couple hundred bucks. He's got a couple errors. And then all of these guys are worth anywhere from 40 to 70 bucks because uh, they have errors as well. So a bunch of error dolls. And if you want any of these, I have not listed them yet, so write them in the comments below. Make me an offer. So I got a list of all those. So I got a ton of Beanie Babies. And I did not go to my dad's attic, which is where the gold is going to be hidden. So next time I go up, um, you got to... My dad's a big dumpster diver, and he finds a lot of stuff throughout the years. He also finds a lot of stuff on clearance so it's crazy that i haven't started reselling earlier i got this head um all right so it's in pretty good condition little head tennis racket these are a pair of tommy bahama golf shoes in pretty great condition a little wear on the top there but look at these things in really awesome condition Tommy Bahama golf shoes. Should get about 30 to 40 bucks on those. I gotta buff these up a little bit, but Johnston and Murphy. I just looked up Johnston and Murphy while I was in the store and these things are like $300 brand new. No clue what they're gonna go for used. I mean, even if it's 30 bucks, that's cool. I paid $35 for everything total that you're gonna see. All of this, uh, all of the Beanie Babies. Uh, I got a brand new Guitar Hero PS2 game sealed, Smash Hits. I got this because I have a, a dance I have a Dance Dance Revolution pad, so I'm gonna try to put them together, and sell this with the pad for 20, 30 bucks. I don't know. I, I cannot find this hat anywhere. It's a Betsy Johnson. Damn, it doesn't look like it was really worn at all. There's like hardly any, if, if any, sweat stains at all. I mean, look at that. It's Betsy Johnson. Figured I can get 20 bucks minimum. I'm shooting for 40 for that. So I got, got all this, and then all right. So that's just that uh, was all 35 bucks from that estate, uh, not state sale, from that thrift shop. So, uh, let me know what you think how I scored in the comments down below. All right, now I'll show you the stuff that I invaded my dad's house. Bunch of stuff here. All right, so this was laying around sealed. I never used Wi-Fi range extender. 50 to 75 bucks for that. Don't know why I grabbed these, but I was gonna buy a racket, um, not a tennis racket, but a racquetball racket and pair these up, it's just two uh, racquetballs. Pops had this laying around. I don't know, I figured I can get 10 bucks for it, Scooby-Doo. The Game Boy Advance. All right, we got some Bushnell PowerView camouflage, it's new in the package, 16 times zoom. 60 to 80 bucks for those. These are 20 to 30 bucks. They're light up golf balls. You kind of hit them and you could play at night, I guess, for the people who just can't wait till the morning. Got three golf balls that light up. There's like a blue, a green, and a red one. 20 to 30 bucks for that. That one. 30 bucks on eBay. It's a Hitaker. No, I guess 
do this way. It's a Hitaker DVD, portable DVD, CD, MP3, TV. It's got everything you need. The accessories to plug into your car, plug into a TV. It's got a remote control and it still works. I tested it. So I'll put that up for 30 bucks. Yeah, check this out. Brand new with the box. Reebok Reclines, Jets sneakers, still got the tags, size 11 if you want them, brand new, never worn. Check them out, NFL Reclines, size 11. And Dad must have got these at Clarence because he would have never spent this much money. These things are like $150 brand new. Obviously, you can see these have never been worn. Heavy duty waterproof bogs uh, boots. These are a size 12 if you want them. Ultra mids bogs. They are minus 40 degree waterproof, uh, Durafresh. These are great. So, lifts the those for maybe, I think they're at 120, I have them listed for. Check this out, it's still in the box that I'm going to use to deliver it. Wireless headphone system. Ion Telesounds. 75 bucks right here, 80 bucks. Still sealed. So, Dad had a bunch more stuff, but I didn't, um, didn't have a lot of room in my car. So, when I go back, there'll be a lot more from, uh, between Dad's basement and dad's attic which we haven't filmed yet there's tons of stuff i've been trying to tell him to sell on ebay for years he's never done it so now that uh now that i'm starting to sell he's going to be a good source to, to to get my uh seed money up what'd you think of the thrift sale hall <laughs> the thrift store hall and the dad hall <laughs> taking stuff from pops he wants me to give him all the money for this but i'll probably give him half because I'm doing most of the work.